Hi everybody, hello. I have a very special guest here with us today. A little foxy Miss Eva. Hi Eva. Hi. Hi. And Eva, of course, is my daughter. And she is off school now because we are in what is Thanksgiving Thanksgiving we, break. On the Thanksgiving break, that's right. Hi Shelby! We already have a we already have a viewer, baby. Uh hi, we love you too. So we are on uh Thanksgiving break. And I wanted to do something, and Eva actually had an awesome idea because we were, I wanted to create a treasure box for the universe where we put our ideas to manifest. And she said to wait because she had a great idea. And she, Shelby says, hi, Eva. I say, hi, Shelby. Hi. <laughs> um, she had a really good idea. Let's move this guys away a little bit so it's not, yeah, so we can see you. Uh, where she thought we can do a doll for our worries and I thought it was brilliant so we decided to use this Russian matryoshka doll which is of course is hollow and empty inside what happened to us our internet is crazy and um, so we decided to use this lady over here and uh, excellent idea see this is Eva's was a great idea and then we are going to use different post-it notes and we're gonna write and draw on it to represent our worries so we already started writing some stuff down for you guys and one of them is what baby you did this one it's a it's a bubble in a bubble and what does it mean it means that um i think um i I worried about somebody um would be mean in my whole entire school. Just one person will be mean to me. Mean to you? Mr. Trezor is trying to, to jump on the action. So you are worried about somebody, a single person being mean to you in school and yeah. saying bad things about you? Yeah, in the whole entire school. Oh wow! Okay, I can understand that. Only so, one person. shall we put it to the to the worry lady? Yeah. Okay, so you put it inside. Where should I put it? Just put it inside wherever. You can tape it, or you can just put it in. You know, I am also worried a lot of times of people saying bad things to me. So I think I'm gonna also, I'm gonna I'm gonna also do something like that. Okay, and I'm gonna write blah. Bleh. Bleh. I want to do something. Like you want to do something? Like, well, you're going to go next. So here it is. <laughs> Puppy. Yes, this is Mr. Trezor over here. This is my blah, blah, blah. And this is also my concern of people just talking nasty stuff about me. So I'm going to put it inside. What is your next idea? What are we worried about? I'm also worried about that things I can't see in the nighttime might really happen when I don't know it. Okay, so you said something about like you're afraid that something's going to be watching you while you're sleeping at night, right? Yes. Okay, that's a big one. So how should we, what should we do about it? I don't know how to figure out how to write it. Do you want to maybe do something that represents watching? Yeah. Like... Two pairs of eyes. Two pairs of eyes. <laughs> excellent idea. Most excellent. Mm -hmm. Right? Shelby is on our side. Baluki! Miss Lulu! Mr. Trezor! Okay. Okay. I did two pairs of eyes. Okay, she did two pairs of eyes. Can I show you? Yeah, you definitely, you should be showing that. Okay, here we go. So, this is what I draw, two pairs of eyes. Two pairs of, pairs of eyes, I love it. They're going to go right inside. Okay. We okay. can just, you know what? I'm going to even do like this, crumple it up so it becomes a small, tiny worry. And I'm going to throw it right in there. I could do that too. Okay, you do that too. Okay. Can I fix fix this one yes I you want to cr crumple 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 those bad words up uh -huh. until they disappear okay and I also said that a lot of time like many other parents 
I'm worried about Mr. Dollar or about money. Right? <laughs> Mr. Dollar. <laughs> Mr. Dollar over here. So we're going to crumple it up and we're going to eliminate this worry immediately to keep the abundance roads open for us. So it's going to go in there. Oh. What else? What else can we think about? What are you worried about? I'm worried about that on my birthday something that I didn't know would happen. And ruin your birthday? Yeah. Oh, okay. So how should we write it out? Um, or draw it? Or... Uh, like something would be knocked down. Something. Ooh, that's kind of hard thing to draw. Um, I let's don't... see how we can do it. Oh, we could write bump. Bump. Bump is a good one. How do you, do you spell bump? B. B. U. U. M. M. P. 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 Bump. And I'm doing an exclamation point, so it's like you can see it's loud. Perfect. You want to take this and show it? I don't even know if I've used these ones before. Let's see if it's easy to do. One help. Yeah. Like this one looked like a little bit. See, we have a little bump here. Opening this up, but we will be successful. Okay, hold on a second. I think I'm pretty much there. Okay, hold on. Here you go. Kind of broke a little bit. That's okay. That's a worry. We we are okay with that. So I had a worry about that on my birthday something would happen and something would fall down and um it would say bump. Oh, okay. It would fall down and then some. Uh, and something just... is going to ruin your birthday. Yeah. Okay, so we don't want that to happen. So we're going to voice that worry and crumple that paper and going to put it to the worry lady. Uh -huh. Okay, take it, worry lady. You're cool. You know what to do. Because the worry lady, you know, guys, what's good about the worry lady is that she knows what to do with this stuff. Even when we don't know, she can take care of it and she can handle it. So there is no reason for us to walk around with those bumps and those worries and those Mr. Dollars that cry and say, you cannot have me, we're going to put them in there. Okay, let me see. Um, what am I worried about? I am worried about that I'm going to do my podcast, my show with um, Jay at night on Wednesday and something is not going to work, something technical and nobody going to be able to hear it. So I'm going to, I think I'm going to draw a microphone. And uh, that is going to represent that. And, and you could do some lines coming out so it's like you can't hear anything else. Ooh, I like this idea. It's a good idea. Hold on, babe. She's so smart. I know where she got it from. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to do something. It might look like a microphone. It might look like ice cream cone, okay? You're always good at drawing, so I know what it will be. Okay, I'm gonna try to draw it like that. And that's gonna be some broken crazy lines. It doesn't look like um it doesn't look like an ice cream cone. So <laughs> it looks more like a microphone than an ice cream cone. Yeah. That's an achievement right there. Hold on a second. So let me take it out. So I put a microphone for technical difficulties. <laughs> so you know what? I'm gonna go wild and I'm gonna rip it apart. That's not gonna happen. Okay, do you want to do another one? Yeah. Okay. So, I'm worried about if I was playing, um, I would go a little wild and then I I wouldn't be able to um um let myself stop and um then all my toys would just break apart. Uh, all the toys I was holding would just break apart. Oh, that sounds like a mess. Okay, so sh what should we do? This is 90% of child intelligence derived from their mother. <laughs> oh, hey, Cassandra. Um, thank you, Shelby. I appreciate it. Um, so um, how about we... So what are we going to draw? Are we going to draw... I want to draw it on this one. Okay, you can draw it on this one. Okay. Do you want a thin one? Do you want the thin side of it? Yeah. Okay, so you can draw on it. And what are you going to draw for it? Um, Hi, Cassandra. Like tiny um, things. Like... Oh, does it not draw? 
we might want to use the other side. Okay. Oh, help? Okay, you got it. Let me cover this one and you can use it. Okay, here we go. Okay. Like a head and some arms are going to be sticking okay. out. And some legs and the clothes is going to be over here. So if you guys are just joining us, we are making a little worry doll. It was Eva's idea. We were thinking about the video to make and she came up with this brilliant idea where you can take a doll. I'm going to talk to you about some ideas of what you can use. And to represent your worries, you can write them out or draw them out just like Eva did. And she did something brilliant because she's afraid that she's going to be too wild playing. She's going to break all of her toys. So I think it's a toy that has... Um, body parts disconnected brilliant i love it and so we write our worries or we draw them out and then we crumple them or tear them apart i'm gonna go crazy and crumple this one uh, do it and then we are gonna throw them inside oh let's see it we're back and uh <laughs> we are uh, using this russian matryoshka doll because it was easy and we had it on hand but let's talk to them about what kind of um, things they could use if they don't have matryoshka dolls. Uh, you could use bags. You can just use a bag, right? Yes. Maybe a Ziploc bag. Uh, or a smaller type of bag. Like what? Like what you have for your money or something like that? Yeah, like a tiny purse. Like a tiny purse. That you, you wanna... can open up. Oh, okay. That's a good idea. I'm sure we have like five of them floating around, but we can't think about anything. What else? Or you could use... Maybe you can use a doll that has pockets on and you can put oh, the yeah. pa pockets in. Or like a, a doll who has like a zipper on her clothes. Or a zipper on her clothes. That's a good idea. What if they don't have any dolls? What if they're boring adults and they don't have any... I'm sorry. Yeah. If they don't have any dolls because they're adults, can they use a box? Yeah. A, a, t um, a small box. A small box would work. But if you can't open it, um, just make a tiny um hole in the top, so um it's like a a money thing, but not um for money. Oh, so it's like um um like a bank. Yeah, but you put your worries in the bank. Oh, so it's a worry bank. Uh -huh. So we don't have. Oh, let's be careful. So it's a worry bank. So we don't. That's a good idea. So we don't have to carry those worries with us, and we can just put it in that worry bank, and it will handle it for us. Yeah. You know, there's a thing like that, and I, I made a video a long time about it, a long time ago. There, is, there are dolls in Latin America that's called worry dolls. And they're usually in a container, and you shake them, you say your worries, you shake them, and then it's supposed to take your worries away. It's like a magical thing. So do you want to shake this so it takes her worries away? Uh -huh. So she can be a worry lady like that? Ooh, I like it. That your worry container can become a musical instrument, apparently, because it's kind of like a shaker. You can hear all your worries like they're um, tiny pieces of things who are doing all your worries and they're going away into something that you would never think would be possible. Oh, beautiful. So they become something that we actually like and they're good things. Yes. I Something like that. Something would never be possible. You never thought it would be possible. Okay. Oh, look at those ideas. Just writing worries out and putting them out. So let's shake it up. Let's shake it for everybody who's going to watch it. May their worries going to go away and go shake, 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 shake into the shaky ladies. Shake, shake, shake. Strong, strong, strong. Take all those worries away. And we are worry clear. And they are transformed, she says. So, do we have any other worries? You want to do another worry? Or are we done? I think we're pretty done. What do you think? One more worry. Oh, one more. She has one more worry. Okay, uh -huh. let's do it. My worry is that when I wake up, nobody's going to be in the house. Ooh, that's a serious worry. I remember worrying about something very similar when I was little. So, what are you going to do for it? I'm going to... Like, um, making a shocked face on my face. Ah! Like this? Yeah. Okay. Uh, um, can you help me draw a shocked face? Okay, which parts of the face do you want me to draw? Um, 
the mouth mostly. Okay, is it gonna be an open mouth? Yeah. Okay, cool. I think I can try. I don't promise. Okay. I made my nose kind of weird. Why? Why do you did it? Already did the 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 nose look like looks like a mouth. I'm gonna make like this. I'm gonna make hair like around like oh oh my god! I just woke up and my hair is crazy. Where is everybody? Okay. Is it good? Can you pull it out? Yeah. Okay, do you want to show everybody? Yeah. So, this is my idea. So Let's get it. This is our terribly looking shocked face when you wake up in the morning and you are alone in the house. So, so that does not happen and you're not left alone, right? We're doing this and we're going to put it in the worry department. Department. Okay. <laughs> Bye bye. Bye bye. And no more worries. And now all your worries will go away. Eva is a great shaker. <laughs> mm, thank you for watching us. This was Madame Nadia and Miss Eva. Bye. Bye.